So one of the coolest things about gene regulation in eukaryotes is how it works. Um, basically, we have our nucleosomes, which is just our DNA wrapped around a histone protein. And it's kind of really rad how um, we can turn on or off gene expression. So if we look over here on the right, there's something called histone acetylation, where we can add acetyl groups to the histone proteins, which causes them to kind of loosen. So you can see in this area how there's a gap between nucleosomes um, that allows room for RNA polymerase to attach and also transcription factors. That's what the TF stands for. So in this um, area on this side, the DNA or the histone proteins have been acetylated. Oh, I may have said that wrong. But it's histone acetylation and now RNA polymerase can attach and you can express the gene. On the opposite side, if we have histone deacetylation, we remove the acetyl groups and we actually bring the nucleosomes closer together so now RNA polymerase is blocked from attaching. This is one way we can, or part of the reason, we can regulate gene control in eukaryotes. Now we can also see it in this picture where we have um, the acetyl groups are represented by stars. And you can see on the right hand side where there's um, the histone proteins are acetylated, uh, RNA polymerase can attach and so can transcription factors. And yay, messenger RNA is made. And on the left hand side, uh, it's deacetylation, and now the nucleosomes are bound very closely together, and transcription is blocked. The genes are not expressed.